Hi, and welcome to the seventh part of these tutorials. On this part, we are going to talk about variables. A variable is nothing but just a name given to a storage area that our program can manipulate. For example, string message is equal to hello world. In C sharp, a variable is always defined with a data type. A variable can be declared and initialized at the same time, or it can be declared and initialized later. For example, instead of writing string message is equal to hello world, we can write string message and then we write message is equal to hello world. You can also declare multiple variables at the same line. For example, string, first name, comma, last name. And you can add as many variables as you want, but all of them need to be of type string. You need to be careful what you assign to your variables. The data type needs to be the same type as the declaration type. So for example, in the last name, let us try to assign an integer value. And we see that we get an error. If we hover over here, it says that cannot implicitly convert int to string. If you want to learn more about implicit type conversion, go and check the last part. A value must be assigned to a variable before using it. Otherwise, it will give a compile time error. So I will try with the first name, console.writeLine first name, and I see that I get an error which says use of an assigned local variable first name is not allowed. So guys, this is all for this part. If you have not subscribed yet, make sure that you do so you do not miss the upcoming parts and see you on the next one.